Hey guys, what is up? It is Shadow Blade here, and I am back with Sneak Peek Week Day 3 and Day 4. Um, I missed yesterday, I was a little busy and did not manage to record a video before I went to sleep, but uh, I'm going to be doing both Sundays and Mondays uh, in this video. So, uh, starting off, we have the Clan War opt-in or out, which came out Sunday. And uh, basically what this does is you can go in your profile and there will be a little button that says Clan Wars. And if you tap on that, you can either say you're in, which means you can be included, or out, which means you can't. So uh, any clans that have members that they don't want in there, you no longer have to kick them out or make them go to the bottom of your clan so that they're not in war. They can just opt out of the war. Um, and now it says here... Uh, your preference will be visible to other clan members, so anybody can check and see whether you're in or out of the war. Uh, so that seems like a pretty cool feature. And next we have clan XP and perks. Um, this came out today, which is Monday. And uh, basically what this allows you to do is you can level your clan up uh, through XP, and then each level gives you perks. Um, and the perks came as a forum exclusive sneak peek, which I'm going to look at right here. And uh, basically what happens is uh, at level 2, you uh, your troop request wait time is 15 minutes instead of 25 minutes. And uh, you can hold 10% more loot in your storage, war loot storage, which is uh, pretty cool um, for all of you who get epic loot and... Have better loot than me. <laughs> um, at level 3, you get a 20% troop cost donation refund, and you get 10% extra loot in war. Um, I believe that is a war bonus for when you win. That is what it looks like to me. Um, next, at level 4, uh, your donation limit goes up to 6 troops. So you can donate 6 troops per person instead of 5 which is pretty cool, um, and then your storage goes up by 20% for your war loot, so your clan castle will be able to hold more war loot, um, at level 5, um, every time you donate a troop, your troop will go up one level in the other person's clan castle, um, that's what it looks like to me, I'm not sure if that's a war only kind of thing, or if that counts all the time, um, again, not sure if any of these, uh, count like that um at let's see we're at level at level six oh and you uh level five you also get a uh, 15 percent extra loot in war at level six uh you get 35 percent of your troop cost back when you donate and your uh war loot storage goes up by 30 percent uh so that's pretty cool i believe the next is uh level seven um your troop request wait time goes down to 10 minutes, so you're now 15 minutes shorter than you used to be, and you can get 20% extra loot bonus in war. Uh, now next up is at level 8, your donation limit goes up to 8 troops, so you can donate 8 troops to people if they have that much room, or if you're using like an archer or something to donate, uh, you can donate 8 of those now. Um, next is you also get 40% added to your war loot storage so that's pretty cool now level 9 clans get a 50% refund um when they donate troops and you get 25% extra loot and finally level 10 when you donate troops your troops grow up two levels in the other person's clan castle and your extra storage goes up to 50% so you can hold 50% more than what you could hold with your clan castle at the level that it was last time. Or, like, so, like, if you have a level 4 clan castle, you can hold 150% of what you had, before, of what you could hold before. So that's pretty cool. Um, so that should be it for this video, guys. I will, uh, there's another sneak peek. I think there might be another one tomorrow. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, if there is, I will make sure I get a video out for that tomorrow. Um, hope you guys enjoyed, and hope you guys can't wait for this next update. Shadowblade out.